in motion coffee. No time for the quarterback, though, as Hold is brought down at the one-yard line by Frank Denard. Well, Frank Denard's some player. He's got a he's got a heck of a story behind him. Here we'll get a chance to take a look at Frank Denard making this play. He just beats the man straight up front. His straight out power move. He over overpowers the center and makes the play. But old Frank Denard, they call him Meat. The youngest and the heaviest player on their team. And he's a guy in training camp. He ordered 10 pizzas, six for himself and four for his teammates. You think he likes to eat? For the week or the night? <laughs> for the afternoon. <laughs> Second down and 14, the ball on the one-yard line. Hold. Back to pass. Boy, Holt had a lot of time on that play. Jackson's a great defensive back for Dallas. He's their, he's their big hitter on their ball club. They're playing a zone. Holt stood right to Mark Jackson, to Jackson in that particular play. Mark made a great play. Jackson's first interception of the year, and Dallas strikes like lightning here. Drew Pearson's got to be happy. It is 12 zip with 10.47 to go in the period. And look at that Dallas sideline. Now power comes back on for the point after attempt. And this one is good. Power now just two of seven on the year, but it's Dallas night so far. We'll take a look at this play again from down on the field as Hold in his own end zone, Tony. Yeah, Hold is dropping, dropping back. He's, Dallas is in a zone. Hold goes right into the strength of the defense. Mark Jackson was standing right there in the corner spot. Here you get a chance to look at it. Here's a crossing route, and here comes Jackson from his zone spot and makes the play. Gets up and rolls into the end zone. Great play by Mark Jackson. Dallas, I was talking to Coach, Coach Nolan. He said they're going to use multiple defenses, a lot of man-to-man -man and a lot of zone to keep him off guard. There's a look at Aaron Mitchell, the guy we called AMPM, and he was known for that because of the way he used to hit guys on the football field. He'd put you out. Well, he's got to be happy as the whole coaching staff. Jackson, a nine-yard interception return. The kickoff will come back out and be first down and ten at the five-yard line on the touchback. In arena football, remember, there is no punting in this game. The nets are in play. The sideline wall is in play as long as you keep your feet in bounds. Now the remainder for the offensive line for Denver, John Norris and Mike Freeman. Freeman, a veteran, played in the NFL with the Denver Broncos, part of two Super Bowl teams. Joe March out of Murray State. First and ten, the ball on the five for the Dynamite. Down 13 zip in the early going. Keep it on the ground. Nice run out across the 10-yard line as Marshall Foreman out of Arkansas. And Meet Denard and Jeff Hurd make the tackle. There's the starting Lineup for the Texans defensively with Hurd, Denard, Co-Star, Moore, Ward, and Akins. The specialist on the defensive end for Drew Pearson's group, Jeff Jenkins, a defensive back out of Utah. And Mark Jackson, who had the interception for the TD of nine yards a moment ago. 9.38. Here's hold on the season, 22 of 47. Thrown for four, been intercepted twice. Complete. And another thing to remember is you see those walls there. A ball thrown off the wall is live and in play as long as you receive it in bounds and as long as the ball hasn't bounced first. But when it comes off the ball full flush, it is a, a live ball and free game. Clock moves in indoor football until the final minute of the first half and final minute of the ball game.